Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about Stockmans, why they're useful, and why I like them. This is a case Stockman from the 50s, I believe. 60s. 65 to 69. Maroon bone. It has half stops, carbon steel. It was abused. Still a perfectly good knife though. They're useful mostly because of how many blades they have. You can use each one for different uses. That's one of the reasons why I like them. This one is stainless. It's another case from the 80s. This one was in brown bone at one point. It was left out in the sun and the scales were dried out. They turned white. I was able to bring them back a little bit, but not as much as I wished I could. Not the best condition, but what can you do? Pen blade, spay blade, and a clip point. All around three great blade shapes to use. Then this one's my current EDC that I swap out every once in a while. It is a Kershaw, let's see here. 4382 RB. The RB is for red bone. You've got a clip point, a sheep's foot, and a spay blade. Overall, great knife. I love this thing. Three blades made of D2 for $23. I'm not going to complain about that at all. That's a new... Oh, okay, there we go. Anyway, today we're going to be talking about something new. So, my cousin's birthday is in a few months. We decided that he should have this for the summer instead of waiting. Case makes Stockman's, obviously. Here's one of them. And they made them in white bone. And I showed it to him and he thought, oh, that's pretty cool. Little did he know when I was showing him that, that they also had this. This is a Case Stockman in collaboration with John Deere. He is a avid John Deere fan. Collects John Deere memorabilia. Here's all the stuff that it comes with. And here is the knife. Green isn't really my favorite color, but this does look pretty dang good for green. Look at that. Clip point. Spay blade. And your pen blade. This is just such, such a nice knife. These are the same pattern, other than this one being a collaboration. Overall, God, it just looks so good. If you've been with me for a while, you know that I've moved, I'm starting to move away from modern stuff and moving more towards traditionals like these. God, just look at that. Now, I don't remember Case's whole deal with dating blades or dating knives. So, I'm not the person to ask what that year is. I'm thinking it's an 18, but I'm not 100% sure. If anybody wants to leave what you're going to say in the comments, that would be great. The number is... 63087. It is in stainless steel. Their stainless steel is 420HC. They call it True Sharp. The. What's it called? Composition of that steel is 85.44% iron, 0.4% silicon, 0.4% manganese. 
13% chromium, 0.3% vanadium, and 0.46% carbon. Out of all the knives that I own, 0.46% carbon isn't exactly what I'd call high, but HD, HC stands for high carbon, so I'm not going to complain. It should treat him well. He will be watching this if you want to say anything like happy birthday or something, though it's a couple months early. In the comments, please feel free to do so. I appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully you guys have a wonderful day, and we'll see you in the next video.